Hey guys, it's Jake here with eTrailer. Do you ever wonder how your drum brakes work on your trailer? Today we're going to show you how. To better understand how they work, first we'll go over the components. First up, you're going to have your brake drum itself, which is going to house all the components for the brake assembly on the inside. And what its job is to do is to create friction. The brake pad itself will rest against the inside of the drum and the magnet is going to stick to the face of the hub here. Next up, we'll have the brake pads, which are gonna be on the outside here. Um, different from your traditional disc brakes, which are going to pinch the side of a disc, either side, like on a vehicle. Um, on a brake drum, they're going to push out on that outer rim that we were just talking about on the drum itself. And then lastly, we're gonna have our magnet down here at the bottom. So the way that your brake drums are gonna work is that your wheel and tire is going to be attached to the face of your brake drum. And it's going to roll in this case for this specific brake setup, it's gonna roll in this direction. So when you apply the brakes, it'll send an electrical signal to this magnet, which will then be activated which will stick to the inside plate. And because this brake drum is moving with the rotation of the tire, it's going to grab onto this magnet and force this brake pad out against the inside of the brake drum. And then in order to ensure smooth braking, after the first brake pad is applied, what will happen is the harder and harder you push the brake, the more and more this pad is going to push against the inside of the brake drum, which will then activate the other pad. So it's gonna start in different stages so that you don't have all of the application at one time. Well guys, hopefully this explanation was easy enough for you to understand how brake drums work. If you have any questions or comments, or if you've got another idea that you, or a question that you'd like answered, please leave it in the comment below and we'll see you next time.